Welcome back to Anything German Shepherd. In order to finally put the myth about the pit bull being an overly aggressive and physically dominant breed to bed once and for all, we're going to find out which breeds are stronger based on three criteria. Bite pressure and power, physical endurance and strength, and size and weight. If we're basing strength purely on biting power, then the title of world's strongest dog belongs to the Rottweiler. Their bite is capable of producing 150 kilos per centimeter of pressure, which helps to explain their formidable reputation as both guard and watchdogs. Mastiffs are big and bouncy, and their bite is only slightly less powerful than that of the Rottweiler, with a bite that produces 145 kilos per centimeter of pressure, which is more than enough to obliterate anything they bite down on. This now brings us to the German Shepherd. There are a number of reasons why German Shepherds are the military and police's chosen canine partners, and even though it's not the most important, their bite power of 110 kilos per centimeter of pressure plays a part in that decision. Compared to the dogs who top the bite power chart, the pit bull doesn't even come close to the number one spot, as its bite only generates 106 kilos per centimeter of pressure. In terms of endurance and strength, working dogs, or dogs that were originally bred to be working dogs, dominate this category, with German Shepherds topping the list. Bright, intelligent, and physically capable, these working dogs are not only strong, but their endurance levels are also legendary, which is why they're commonly regarded as the strongest dogs in the world. Coming in after the GSD is the Siberian Husky. Don't let their fluffy good looks and gentle demeanor fool you. Underneath all that fur, huskies are all muscle. Their ability to drag dog sleds over vast distances without resting until the day's work is done, and then get up the next morning and do it all over again, makes this breed one of the strongest and most physically capable in the canine kingdom. This now brings us to the whole package and the real deal, the Doberman Pinscher. Its unwavering devotion and single-mindedness mean that it won't give up or give in, and will just keep on going until it achieves whatever task it's been set. So where does the pit bull place in the strength and endurance chart? According to most kennel clubs and veterinary lists, it barely makes the top 20. This now brings us to our final category of size and weight, as a clear indication of just how strong certain breeds are. The English Mastiff is recognized by the AKC as being the biggest overall dog breed in the world, standing close to 30 inches tall and weighing as much as 250 pounds. Great Danes may not be as heavy as the English Mastiff, weighing on average around 110 pounds, but they are the world's tallest dogs, and can grow to be nearly 44 inches tall. In third place is another Mastiff, the Neapolitan, a dog that usually weighs between 120 and 130 pounds, and can grow up to 31 inches tall. So where does the pit bull appear on the canine size and weight chart? Well, as they're usually between 15 and 20 inches tall, and weigh on average between 50 and 60 pounds, they're way down the list. So while it's undeniable that pit bulls are strong dogs, they're not the strongest and they're definitely not the most fearsome. And the next time someone tells you that they are, you'll be able to gently correct them and tell them all about the German Shepherd, the Rottweiler, and the English Mastiff. Thanks for joining us today. Please feel free to subscribe to our channel and newsletter, and don't forget to hit the like button. Until next time.